What's up guys, it's Bob and we're back again with another boss fight uh, Thanks to my friends again for allowing me to use this account As you can see, I will not be using the Electro Shogun Because it's just, just a dumb move if you ask me uh, I'll be fighting the Electro Nip boss So obviously I'm gonna change the Radiant Shogun to the Geo Archon known as Zhongli uh, I'll be using two Pyro characters, Bennett and Yoimiya is obvious uh, Diona will be my healer and the Zhongli will just give me more defense stats and uh, here are their stats, I'll be showcasing them without changing them as promised. And uh, yeah, so this boss fight, it came to me that I rest, I cannot keep up with this tradition. I, I almost forgot that uh, there are probably two bosses that I cannot use Raging Shogun to end it. This is uh, basically a dumb move like, if I have to use them. Uh, so it will be this Electronic and the Electro Hypostasis. Yeah, uh, sorry about that if I cannot keep up this tradition, I mean... I thought I could end everything with the Radiant Shogun, but that has to come to an end. But uh, regardless of how it goes, uh, the boss-wise is pretty easy to fight. Uh, I would say the Electro Knit is just about the same as the Electro Hypostasis. They will throw attacks at you, you just dodge as fast as you can and attack. There's no like second phase of whatever you have to do. Uh, I'll eat some food because, you know, why not? So the Electro Knit boss, you can find it in the Serai Island which is on top of this massive cliff hill thingy and uh, yeah, I will begin by going in with uh, Zhongli's shield because I never play Zhongli, I believe that what his elemental skill is, does is give me a defense and then Diona also gives me defense, so haha, <laughs> I have double the defense so in this early stage, I'll straight away use uh, Yormias first and then shoot every all of my normal attacks with pyro damage Okay, so this electro gate is pretty easy to dodge. It's either you walk forward or backwards. Yeah, don't don't ever go to go left or right. Okay, so get more shields with uh, Yona. Okay, now there's this electro gate thing will chase you. In this method, you have two ways to counter it. Either first you do an elemental burst, like two elemental bursts to stop it from hitting you. Oh shit, I almost got hit by that. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know that Johnny's dick would come out of nowhere. But yeah, um so the electro gate will chase after you. You can use two elemental bursts to counter it, or you can just run around until the thing ends. Yeah. And uh, one of his skills is also shooting this electro spikes at you. That one is pretty easy to dodge. And okay, the electro gate I just walk forward. Oh! <laughs> yeah, so um at first, it will feel like a bit difficult to dodge because like, I'm playing it on a phone. But uh, you, you get used to it as you play more and more. So uh, back to Yormia and the electric gate is gonna chase me again. The cage is gonna be very annoying, so I'm using Zhongli's burst. Then getting out of it. Okay, so at this point, I guess throwing a dick to his face. Okay, get defense from Diona. Going me out with her machine gun. Pew 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 pew. Oh, okay, time to get away. Shit. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's, okay, as long as you don't uh, get hit by both gates at the same time, then you'll be fine. Because that gate is a one shot move that can kill you. So, okay. Yeah, go with uh, some burst, two burst. And then try to end it with Yoimiya. Oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't know she was doing that. And boom. That's that. That was easy. Yep. Uh, though I did get hit by the gate in a lot of times, but the the general rule of thumb is to just walk forward or walk backward lah. Uh, overall, I'll say this boss one is not that difficult. And if you find this enjoyable and you find this helpful, give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.